His work is colorful, vibrant, and as unique as his favorite city. Mark Gonzalez grew up here, and he was inspired by generations of Florida artists. Ted News reporter Bobby Lewis is out on the road in Tampa, where a local man has creativity in his bloodline. Hey, good morning, Bobby. Welcome. Come on in. It doesn't take too many steps into Mark Gonzalez's Tampa townhome. Welcome to my studio. Before inspiration positive energy hits in the world, you. Because God gives us so much, so many beautiful things that people overlook and take for granted. Born at Tampa General, the sixth generation Florida boy stands out thanks to his colorful view on the world. This piece right here was actually inspired by my grandmother. Her name was Magdalena. His subjects may look familiar. You can see the gloss pieces. Even if it's a unique kind of take on the original. I create from my heart and my soul, and it's the greatest gift I can give is just helping people. The famous UT Minarets, where his dad went to school. The Tampa Theater, a place his grandmother visited as a child. That piece took me probably like three or four years to complete. All part of his life, all part of his art. You might hear the term outside the box a lot from artists and Mark has taken those outside the box concepts and firmly placed them inside the frame. He makes art with glass and plastic and metal, anything he can find. But mostly he does it with love, the ingredient he learned from his parents and all the other people in his life who taught him how to do art and the people who helped him fall in love with his city. I try and be an artist that uh, it's going to help make our Tampa Bay area a better place. I was born in Tampa. And I think, I feel it's real important. We have, we have an amazing city, and I think we all need to, uh, to work together to any way we can to help uh, those in need. On the road in Tampa, I'm Bobby Lewis, 10 News. Fascinating really, artwork, yeah. right? Yeah, it is. So, so Bobby's out there, and Bobby says, mm -hmm. Reggie, I got something for you. So Mark sent this to me. It's, it's so beautiful. Cool. Absolutely. I walked in today, and I said, I love and that. And I can't wait. To frame this. Yeah. I really can. Now, Mark oh, gives great. away a lot of his art for charitable causes all around Tampa Bay. He thinks his pieces have raised about $100,000 for his hometown and ours over the years.